major layer to smoothen out smoothen out uh, the crude mortality rates using some processes one with a with an objective one to establish a, a smooth flow across the ages which can uh, bring in uh, the explainability of the mortality rates across different ages but at the same time get more into the adherence uh, to the observed values so i am using the crude rates which i have observed doing some kind of uh, small tweakings to that observed rate so that along with the adherence to the observed i also see that the numbers are smoothly flowing across ages uh, so that the explainability and uh, the premium computation uh, can very well be handled it cannot happen that uh, in case of life insurance uh, policies the premium charged for a 20 year person is greater than the premium that is being charged for a 21 year person uh, and Im immediately again drop for a 22 year the explainability for the same will be much difficult so what we typically see is a gradual uh, a gradual change across the ages so that is where we are using the smoothening mechanisms or the graduation kind of uh, tools and technique to bring out that kind of smoothening across the crude rates crude mortality rate while uh, at the same time ensuring uh, the adherence to the data that is one of the main objectives of using uh, the graduation in our uh, processes majorly arriving at a compromise graduation if i have to define it in a sentence it is primarily a compromise between the adherence to the data and smoothness across the ages so uh, the better method the best method is the one that uh, handles both these things or balances both these things more effectively and in this context is where we are trying to identify the three most uh, commonly used uh, techniques or tools three most commonly used tools to perform graduation the first is with respect to the usage of a parametric formula means we try to use a formula and using that formula we try to smoothen across the ages right so we are using a parametric formula kind of a method or we are referring to a standard table a standard mortality table or a national statistics table which might have already been published i am referring to that particular table or finally i can look at even a quick graphical kind of an approach to do the graduation and uh, this is where now we start uh, looking at the each of these approaches the relative merits and demerits associated with each of the approaches and how they can really fit in uh, uh, in terms of balancing both adherence to the data as well as smoothness associated with it so starting off with uh, the typical parametric uh, formula approach where 